Hello everybody, Iron Wolfman here. Doing a Dynasty Warriors 9 video about money farming and how to get the special horses. Uh, such as Red Hair, Hexmark, and Shadowrunner. So basically how uh, to unlock the horses, you have to complete all the story missions for the characters that pertain to that horse. Such as uh, Dong Zhuo, because he bought the horse. Uh, Liu Bu, because it's kind of his staple, I guess. Uh, part of his image. And he w uses the horse a lot. And then uh, Guan Yu, because he took it after Liu Bu uh, was captured and killed. So, uh, beating the three story missions will unlock it in the shop. And then you need 100,000 gold to purchase it. Uh, I don't know the price for the other two horses. Um, but they are also some semi-expensive. Uh, basically how you unlock Shadowrunner is that you need to finish Cao Cao Dianwei and uh, Jia Xu. Yeah, I don't know the proper tones for all the characters, so forgive me if they're wrong. Um, but yeah, once you beat those three, because Shadowrunner died when uh, Cao Cao was trying to assassinate someone, um, that involved Dianwei being the rear guard and Jashu joining his forces. Um, so they were all relevant to his uh, to Shadowrunner, so I'm assuming when you beat all three you can get Shadowrunner. Uh, when I do unlock it, I will make a video about it. Uh, I am currently trying to get Hexmark, so Pang Tong and Liu Bei are both the characters that have anything to do with that horse. So when I finish those two, uh, I will come back with another video in show you uh, if it worked or not but anyway that's how you get them but another question is how do you get lots of money so uh, completing all these missions can help with getting some amount of gold uh, but how you're mostly going to do it is actually make sure you have the quality tiger belt and the gold crown this will increase the drop rate and the amount of money you get uh, from from killing officers or base captains, etc. So one, I will show it uh, without. It's just to show the difference. Two, three. So let's see how much money I get. I got a hundred gold. Now let's see what happens when I kill this other guy. So he's dead. I got 128 gold. So obviously it's more. <laughs> so having these two will really help you get your gold uh, accumulated. Uh, the next thing to do is be stingy. Uh, since I have red hair and I actually have a lot of money, I decided to buy the Emerald Fan, but usually you don't really need to buy any weapons. As you can see, I only really bought two weapons. Uh, and then, uh, yeah, making sure to pick up the, or break open the boxes that are left behind by base captains. Uh, unfortunately, there are none right here, but uh, usually when you take out a base captain, there will be like three or four three or four boxes right around the area and then they would usually have a topaz circlet, circlet. Uh, as you can see right here sorry yeah these items oops sorry <laughs> but um yeah that's basically it uh if you have any questions please feel free to leave a comment uh, if you like the video, remember to like the video, and uh, feel free to subscribe if you want to see further Dynasty Warriors 9 content. Uh, if any of you guys have any suggestions for videos, um, then please do leave it in the comment section below. If it gets enough likes, I will do a video uh, on that topic. If I can. <laughs> if anything, I will at least address it. So, yep, thank you for watching, see you guys next time. Good luck with 
completing the story missions because those take forever.